The Biofuel Research Centre at Edinburgh Napier University Site Hill Campus is a state-of-the-art facility researching the conversion of sustainable biomass into biofuel. Members of staff and PhD students work in a range of new and innovative organic biomass resources, testing them for potential biofuel conversion. The main expertise of the staff here in the Biofuel Research Centre is Biobutanol, a next-generation sustainable biofuel. Uh, here at the Biofuel Research Centre we focus on a range of disciplines across microbiology, fermentation, molecular biology. Any science uh, background that can help to drive forward developments in sustainable fuel development. The Scottish Government has a very keen focus on sustainable energy. We know a lot about their work in offshore wind and how they've promoted renewable electricity. And biofuel fits in as part of our sustainability programme. And here at the Biofuel Research Centre we're at the forefront of developing sustainable biofuel that will play a part in the development of all of Scotland's renewable energy. All biological material contains energy and carbon which can potentially be converted into a fuel source that we can use to power our motor vehicles. Uh, there are a number of ways we can address obtaining this energy. You can use crops, which is well used throughout the world, and in many cases it can be sustainable. But that's not the only form of biological material that will contain this energy. Waste material will also contain this. And this can be generated from a variety of sources, such as um, waste material from agriculture, waste material from biological industries, and even waste material that we produce ourselves on a daily basis from food consumption. Biofuel can play a very important part in the renewable energy future, but it certainly won't be the only form of energy that we will use. Where biofuel becomes very important in its use is in its use in transportation. Uh, with the current combustion engine prevalent in cars throughout the world, if we want to replace fossil fuel, then the drop-in solution is to put in sustainable biofuel. This will form part of the general sustainable criteria that will come into play with electricity, heating and fuel as part of a global response to sustainability. The research at the Biofuel Research Centre is focused on developing sustainable biofuel. To do this we operate across a range of science disciplines, uh, microbiology, fermentation, molecular biology, anything that will help us to develop an edge in bringing forward technology to support sustainable biofuel. There is a misconception that biofuel is one single entity and this is simply not true. There are very many different types of biofuels and there are very many different ways of making them. In Scotland we make biodiesel as one of the, the largest components of biofuel in the UK. But there's also bioethanol and one of the areas we focus on very much here in the Biofuel Research Centre is biobutanol. The centre works across a range of different substrates that could potentially be converted into different forms of biofuel. All plant and organic material contains carbon and energy which can be converted into a form of energy in fuel that we can use in vehicles. We therefore look across the range of different available substrates in Scotland and beyond that could potentially be converted into different forms of biofuel. For example, one of the high profile initiatives that we had here at the Biofuel Research Centre was working closely with the Scottish whisky industry. Uh, Scottish malt whisky, as we all know, is one of the largest exports in Scotland, but in addition to making this large volume product, the industry also produces a number of other lower value products, and what we did was develop a process for combining these and using our microbiological and fermentation technologies to convert this substrate into a higher value grade fuel which can be used in automobiles without modification to the engine. The Biofuel Research Centre works uh, predominantly um, with Scottish companies to develop our possibilities for impacting on global biofuel, but we also work internationally. We have a sister site in Hong Kong that we're developing. We're also active in India as part of the government's MOU on renewable energy. So this really is a global stage for us to work on. And it's not an insignificant thing because when you consider that oil is a finite resource that is going to run out, we need to find alternative ways of fueling the cars of the future. And the future is just around the corner in this context when you consider that the number of cars in the world is expected to double within the next 15 to 20 years. Simply digging up fossil fuels and using those until we run out of oil is not really a sustainable criteria by anyone's stretch of the imagination. So we must find some way of fueling these vehicles and biofuel allows us the opportunity, when it's produced sustainably, to drop in to existing infrastructure, not reinvent the wheel, but to bring biofuel back to the car. What many people don't realise is that all the first cars were designed to run on biofuel. And in a different world, we might all actually be using biofuel now rather than oil. But we did discover oil, 
and oil has had fantastic advantages for the world, but it's a finite resource, it will run out, and we need to look to the fuel of the future. And biofuel can play an immediate role in helping us to relieve our dependence on fossil fuel, to reduce carbon emissions, and to provide energy security for independent countries so that we're not totally held to ransom by where the availability of oil might be at any point in time in the world.